Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of their excitement and expectation. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? For me, it has to be the magical Angel Di Maria. What I like uh, about him is how he's tailored his game to play in different positions, whether it be central midfield, attacking midfield, or, or as a winger. And, you know, he can adapt to whatever's required. Okay. Shapes to shoot! <laughs> what about that, Jim Beglin? Cavani is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for him. Manchester take the lead. Look, he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net. That's what he's paid to do. Oh, that's nice. And it's Bernat. Bernat puts it into the middle. Roberto Carlos is there to heave it away. And that has been cleared. Roberto Carlos. Forward it goes. Kimpembe. Across the field it goes. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. And here's Pablo Sarabia. Pablo Sarabia. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. He's got the... Has a pop! Terry Sanzema are back on level terms. The first touch was absolutely heavenly, and because of it, the finish was a mere formality. Paris Saint-Germain grab the equaliser and we're all square. Ah, oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked and uh, I still haven't moved. One Bissaka. And here's Cavani. Martial. And the shot! It goes to show he is human after all. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Keira. Di Maria. Di Maria spreads it towards the left. 
And it's Bernat. Pablo Sarabia. Whipped in. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half time. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. It's a really interesting game, and they head in at half time at 1 1. So, we're just settling back into this second half. Uh, they're guilty of lacking inventiveness here. It's all broken down. He's pinged one through here. Matic. Savage. One Bissaka. Matic. Savage. Tries to switch the play. Martial. Matic. Just brushed off the ball there. Marquinhos concedes a free kick for that. Manchester go into the lead. Kimpembe. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Di Maria. It'll be a throw in. He gets past his man. Keira pumps it into the area. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Diogo Dallo looks to dink one in. And he heaves it forward. And here's Dybala, he's had a shot! Oh, that's a fine save! Paolo Dybala sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. And here's Roberto Carlos. Turns and goes back. Out to the right. Balls loose, who's getting there? There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. 
but will they? Matter. He's good for it! It's in! Two up now, and they are cruising. Perhaps deserves a little bit of sympathy here because that's a goalkeeper's nightmare. It's, it's clear that the keeper was unsighted by his defence, and by the time he picked up the flight of that, it was too late. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Manchester, and two up, and into a position of real strength. Di Maria plays it over to the other flank. Idrissa Gay. And it's Di Maria. Diogo Dallo gets it away. Timely intervention. And time is up. Solid, if not especially fancy, always in control. They did enough to win it. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? But this is a good win for me. They know they've got the organisation and the discipline, and that's what gave them the platform to go on and win this. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening. Thank you.